guys, it's Jack Pronkington, and instead of doing a live stream, I thought I'd do just a vlog, kind of talk about this week's Coffee Time with Jack, and uh, what it's about and how it's really important to me. Um, but I think it's a topic that, you know, musicians should hear in general, so if you guys like this format versus a live stream, let me know. You know, I'd still like to do a live stream every once in a while. But I might just stick to doing vlogs like this on Fridays. So, Monday was the 4th of July. That's actually why the Epiphone video was delayed. I didn't want it to come out on the holiday. And, uh, which, uh the guitar, um, is actually a pretty, uh, sweet guitar. But, um, Monday was my first concert that I've played in, in a band, for seven years. The last time I played in a show, it was at Max Bar in Lansing. Like an actual show. I think I've maybe done like one open mic since then. I'm not entirely sure. Which is at a bar that no longer exists. Which I believe was called Moonbeam. Um, but, you know, going that long of a drought without playing live after tasting it is, it's... It's like drugs, honestly. It really is. You know, you go through signs of withdrawal and everything, and getting it back is it's an amazing feeling. It was it was only a thirty minute, forty minute set, which that's just what our set is right now, which is totally fine. It was cool that they had offered, they wanted an encore and everything, um, so we did an impromptu cover, which was pretty actually not bad. Um, the whole live, the whole video of the concert's actually on our Facebook page, which I'll have in the description of this video. Um, it was a live stream. We actually, I tried to record it with the camera that I used for my YouTube videos. Not this. This is just my cell phone. But for um, the reviews, however, I've noticed that my microphone has been kind of blown out lately. So I, I didn't notice it until really this concert. Um, I thought. It had kind of sound like that uh, on Monday's video, but I wasn't quite sure. So I think my microphone might just be going bad and I might have to get a new one, which kind of sucks, but it is what it is. Um, so all of the footage was not really usable because of the audio on uh, the uh, show. But luckily, that's why I made sure that there was a live stream at the same time. So we have a record of it. There's also going to be a bunch of pictures, hopefully posted soon. Um, some other cool stuff with that. If you live in the Michigan area, uh, we're actually going to be on the radio this weekend, Sunday night. Uh, today is the eighth, so I believe the tenth. Yeah, because today's Friday, Saturday is the ninth. So yeah, Sunday the tenth. Uh, 9 p.m. Uh, 101 WRIF, Motor City uh, Riff. So, check that out. <laughs> I'm actually excited to be well, like a part of a project that's on the radio. It's never happened to me in my life. So, it, it, it's really exciting. But anyway, back to my first show. Um, it, it really felt like my first show even though I've done concerts before in my life, you know, it wasn't like it was a big show. It was 20, maybe 30 people at most. It was a 4th of July barbecue with the neighborhood. A few other barbecues came and stopped by. They all talked to us and stuff. It was really hot out. So, and we, we did it in the driveway, which was fun. It was, it was something I haven't done before. And it was a really fun experience. Although I will say afterwards, I was like, I need water, like immediately. <laughs> um, I, I think everything sounded good. The band did. We had a couple of, like PA issues. Um, I think we blown up one of the channels on RPA. I'm not entirely sure. So, but it was it was a great time. I mean, next weekend is another show for us, and I'm. That'll be in an uh, actual venue, and I'm excited for that. But it's just, it's crazy um, to be back in that and to have that feeling again. 
you know, to have people like singing along with you on like a song that they know and that they know of yours, or if you're doing a cover and they know it, uh, to just see people like rock out and then like talk to you afterwards, like, you know, it was, it was cool. I'm, I'm really excited and really happy. Um, so if, if you are a musician, you definitely should at least perform once, obviously. However, if you can, just keep performing. Go to open mics. Go to, you know, talk to your local bar and see if they'll do, like, a little mini concert or something. Because it's, it's fun, you know. And it's not, it's not about being in front of a million people or 30 people or one person. I've done plenty of shows where the only other people there are the other bands. I've done plenty of shows where it's a small little, like, couple friends, and I've done a show or two where it was a room full of people. And it's, it's a great experience either way because you're, you're getting, not surrounded, but, like, you're, you're getting the feedback from them instantly. You're, it's, it's literally, like, you're, Taking in their their good mood while they're taking out your bad mood or your negative energy. If you use that for music, or even if you're positive, it's like recycling, and it's 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 really fun and it's it's great. Um, I don't know. I'm, I'm I'm kind of rambling, and I'm sorry, but I really wanted to talk to you guys about it. Um, I know it's kind of a shorter video this week. I'm sorry about that. Um. Next week's vlog video is going to be a really big one for me, I think, because I really discuss the my issue with a certain company that I love. And, well, that I loved. <laughs> I guess I'll leave it at that. Um, but Monday's video, I'm not entirely sure what really that will be yet. Maybe what... Uh, I'll do is I'll see if I can get that old Harmony Strat to do some metal. I don't know. I might have done that in the review already. I don't really have any new pieces of gear right now. Um, I think I talk about this, but we bought the house. The sale went through. I'm, I'm officially, I own this building. I own this plot of land. And so, you know, the... the funds for new gear is like very limited i actually just ordered some pickups today or yesterday i guess i should say for a project um that when it's done is when i will do i'll show it which hopefully will be in about a month at most and it's something i've been waiting on for to be done for a few years or at least a year or so it's something i've always wanted to get fixed and i'm very excited about that too um, but anyway guys uh, I hope you have a great weekend. This is Jack Punkington signing up. Peace.